here is my room. I'm going to go out of the door. There's a view out of the window. The Canberra night. It's a very long corridor. We'll see you, Jackson. I'm semi dressed. Oh, okay, sorry. Coming. Coming. <laughs> and here's Jock's room. I was fiddling. I do know I can't pay you just one test. Now Jock is going to uh, perform the piece he's been learning. Hello. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, Jock, it's making me nervous. Oh, that's alright. Champagne deal. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm embarrassed now. Oh, you don't have to be embarrassed. What if I switch off? Oh, why is it not switching off? Oh, sorry. finished work and I'm having a glass of wine which I always have just after work and watching the news and I might as well show you a view out of the window there we are that's the new postgrad building they're building for next year and that's a view out of the back window at the moment There's the other half of the college. Anyway, I will switch off now. See you later. Right, we're just going to feed the swans. The shortcut. There's Bergman. Yeah. And oh, what's it, Jug? What do you the way? Oh no, no, no. I might just take. Do you think I should? Yeah. Do you think I should just take the whole whole route? No, I think I should. They'll get bored if I take yeah. the whole route. 
I think it's popped there and then continue as well. I bet the phone will go as soon as it And there we are, we're walking down to Sullivan's Creek. Do you think it's interesting, Jock? It'll be interesting when we get down to the creek. This way. Which way? Oh, that way. I hope Antoinette, you said she doesn't come back at about seven. Hmm? She doesn't come back. That duck. Oh, there's a duck. There's a duck. Should we cross the road? I oh, could do. Oh, which way are we going? Are we going that way? Let's oh, we're going there. left. Okay. Now, here is this is Sullivan's Creek and lots of willows have been planted, so it looks a bit like kind of Oxbridge River, which goes in with a kind of Hello, do you want to be on film? Yeah, let's be on film. Oh, there's Matt and Hi Alice. Hey, Dan's a good luck. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> so, anyway, that's part of the, um, the Oxbridge fantasy, all the weeping willows. Bird flying. There's a bird flying. Oh. <laughs> Could do. Oh, it'd be fun to have a continuous though. Well, perhaps you're right, Doc. Three minutes. You might be like, they'll leverage for Jack and then get headache. And they'll get bored. <laughs> anyway, we're heading down to the river now. We want to find the swans because we're going to feed them bread. Shall we name them? We could name them. What about Danny? Fanny. <laughs> Fred and Fanny, <laughs> the swans. Anyway, there's some students taking part in the usual Australian pastime of sport. There's a new medical school they're building. And there's Sullivan's Creek, which is just next to Bergman. And then there's the college. Well, the sun's come out. If the phone goes, I'll be really annoyed. Isn't it pretty? Yeah. Grass. There's a eucalypt. And there's Sully's Creek. I hope the exposure on this is okay. It should be. I'm worried it might be overexposed. But it's on them. Um, I think it's on automatic. Do you want to put that little peninsula? Could do, yeah, should we, get, we could go down to the peninsula. There's Mount Ainsley you can see in the distance. We're going to head down to the peninsula. from distance. Oh, yeah, the chicks. Where are yeah, the chicks? Yeah, at the end. Oh, where? At the end of the peninsula. Okay. There's a birdie. If I try closely zooming on the birdie. Ah, 
I'm trying to zoom in on the birdie, but my camera skills are not yet sufficiently good. In the instruction manual, they said you should keep the we should keep the sun behind us. So I'm trying to keep the sun behind me. Oh, well, his jock's gone up to the bridge, so I'll follow jock. There are some stepping stones. Shall I cross the stepping stones? I'll try not, not to fall in with the camera. They're squabbling over territory. There are little chicks as well, which look very sweet. Anyway. Why don't you feed the ducks and I'll show you. I'll film you. Oh no. I could do. Okay, coming up is me feeding the ducks. Is it recording? Yes, it is. Hello. Could you, could, you, could, you, could you film me with that phone, please? Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. Oh, it's gone now. <laughs> Where is it now? There is a... Is that a Kurawong, Jock? That's a Kurawong, isn't it? That is a Kurawong, I think. Very out of focus, Kurawong. Oh, there's a magpie. Is it magpie? Oh well, it's a magpie apparently. I wonder if it's in that bird because. I know, it was in, it was like suspended. It looked really interesting. It was hovering. Oh, sorry. No, sorry. No, Where? No, film this, film this. Where? Where is it? There it is. Film this. Ah. Film it. Do you get it? Yeah. It will come back. See, it will come back. Yeah. They all want bread. Do you know why? Because they can catch the bread in the air. Shall I feed this one? They're all fighting over the bread. <coughs> Shall I film you now? I could do. Oh, we could keep you recording. We could keep you recording. I don't know. Wait, what should I do? Don't just be the duck. Yeah, this is part of the thing. Feeding the duck. Don't it pull? And they're strikingly similar to. Um, European ducks. Actually, I think they're probably brought by the Europeans to put it in the river. Oh, there's a little bit of a candy. Did you get a bread? I think so.
Oh, I should go over to the bridge. Oh, they're probably... Oh, there's a lovely... What's over there? I can hear something making a noise. Oh, there it is. They're... What are they, do you think, Josh? Oh, there's a red wattle, wattle neck. They're red wattle necks, apparently. I did a search. And they can catch food in the air. And they can catch food in the air. Got it. Oh look, there it is again. Let me go there. Kadoo. Crows. Are they crows? There's some crows that make terrible noise. You think I've filled enough, Jock? Yeah. Shall we go? Shall we go down to the to look for the Anyway. Stars? That's all for now. Yeah. We're just debating on how well focused the images that this camera produces are. It does focus a bit. Well I'm sure with experience. We're now heading downstream in search of swans. Single duck. Oh, there's a single duck. Oh, look. There's another duck. Unfortunately, the sunlight's actually. We're heading sort of west. So the sunlight, some. There's some weeping willows. I don't think this is going to get any Academy Awards, but... I think we should make a film. I feel bad about what I say, it will be recorded forever on the film. Is this where Ben works? I think this is where Ben works. Oh yeah, the... That's John Curtin, that's um physics building. Anyway, it probably gets a bit more interesting further down. Yeah. Or if I take or if I take the um I could take the solar dish. I'll just pause and then take... Now there is a solar disk. Well, no, no, what am I talking about? Yeah, a solar disk. An experimental design for heating water and solar power. Well, I don't think they use it for much. Anyway, I'll pause again because it's not very interesting. Right, we're just heading under the bridge. Now towards the lake. Lake Bully. Lake Bully Griffin. Oh, it's so... It's absolutely... The light's absolutely beautiful. The are there. Are they there? Unfortunately, I don't know whether this is going to come out from the camera. Shall we stay in the shade? It could do... Oh, I don't know. The mountain, so I could take the left. Because they... Yeah. And there... I don't know if you can see... Is Telstra Tower and the Black Mountain. Doc's running around the corner. Oh, they won't be able to see the mountains, will they, Doc? There's a swan. It knows Doc very well because he feeds them every day. I think it's a black swan. Is it a black swan? Yeah. That reminds me of um is it clay? Hmm? A black swan. Could you it and there's some what's that Joe? Could you could it fly? Oh could do. Did you manage to feel it flying? Yeah, I've got something coming over flying. Can I have a look later? Yeah, I'll just take um I don't know if you can see the mountains in the distance, but there are mountains. And over there, 
is Parliament House, which you can probably see on the horizon. There's a very bright sunlight, so I don't want to put it into the sun. And you can see the little cygnets too. Look at the coots. And they're coots too. Do you think it's the mummy swan or the daddy swan? So no, are male swans bigger or female swans bigger? I don't know, I don't know anything about it. Anyway, those are the cygnets. Ooh, it's getting a bit... Do you want me to film your feeding them? Oh no, it's okay, Chuck. I think I'll just get a spawn. Oh, it's like pause now. <laughs> You've seen Black Mountain? There we are, there's Black Mountain. What a greedy spawn. Greedy yeah, the greedy spawn. Doc's about to throw some bread. How about to distract the mother's one? Look at that. Can I feed the coots? Good to you. There are the coots. Hi Daniel. <laughs> oh, there's Cheng. Yep. There's I'm Yumiko Cheng. and Paul. The focus is a bit dodgy. I don't know why it won't focus properly. Isn't that a fantastic camera? I know. <coughs> anyway, you're now immortalised forever on film. Great. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Hello, I thought since um I've recorded quite a few shots of um, feeding the swans, um, some of the some of the things that um, I get up to. But I thought you haven't really seen much of me, have you? So I thought I'd take a, just a shot of me. You know, here I am. And um, in a few minutes, I'm going out for dinner, and um, I'll try and take a few shots of that as well. I don't know whether people I'm going out for dinner with will like being um, filmed. But anyway. Yes, yeah, so it's now sort of 20 past 5 and I'm going to pop down to Civic. I probably won't take um, the entire um, shot of the entire um, journey because it might get a bit boring. But I'll try and give you some of the highlights. Bye! Here is the Civic Centre and you can see just over there the High Court of um, Australia. Lots of um, skyscrapers and such. Yeah, there's some more skyscrapers over there, if you can call them skyscrapers. It looks as though it might rain actually, the sky's a bit, um, which would be a good thing here, because water supplies run low. And when it rains, it's a very good thing. But it's actually looking quite nice and sunny over there, so I'm not sure it will rain. So there we go. We're walking into Civic. And I'm going to meet uh, Nicola in the pub. Hello again. Just walking along here and round the corner to the pub where I'm meeting 
Nicola? Called the Wigan Pen. Well, let's go around here. And there's a pub just there. I think I'll stop recording because it might annoy people. There is a pint of... <laughs> so, oh, like young girl uh, can make it because she's gone off somewhere. Uh, I'll take one of the... Oh, I'm driving um, up to Sydney. I did mention it earlier to die. She said maybe, like, just send her an email. Which is a very good but, pub. Yeah, no reply. Um, I think. There's Nicola. Also... There's Nicola. Yeah, didn't hear anything from That's clear. Judy. And Carl. Hello. Hello. <laughs> and, oh dear, I'm very bad with names. Andrew. 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 Sorry, there's Andrew. Yeah. There is the centre of Civic. And this is the Northbourne Avenue. And that leads eventually to Sydney. Anyway, we're going to a restaurant now. I don't think they like being filmed, so I'm not going to film them. That's very interesting. You're a tad nervous, aren't you? No, I'm not actually. I'm quite excited. Let's go with Lois. Yeah, yeah, that's interesting. Hello, Lois. Okay, don't tell them about it. It's been doing different Yeah, yeah. East keep away from the border because they still run a lot of drugs and yeah, that's why I think there. There we go. Like, like a huge beard and one of those people and he noticed after September 11th that he got stopped at the airports a lot more regularly oh, um, because he I'm looks right quite Arabic. Yeah, so the, um, the whole idea that there's no... You, know, you are recording, aren't you? Oh, he's great. <laughs> pleasure in this, aren't you? Oh, you? Well, you're going for a point there. All of the anti-racist stuff. It is true. It's true. It's true. It's, it's, true. it's not. Oh, yeah. Horrible. Understandable in some ways, but it's not justified. Well, for the camera, it's going to be It's pretty nifty, isn't it? Oh, it flips around. Oh, that's quite a nifty feature as well. For the sake of... Uh, well, you can use the viewfinder as well. <laughs> I couldn't get the zip to work. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> My parents are just looking at it. That we're going to get a crazy button. Yeah, we're going to get a crazy button. But still, it would be good. I'm trying to have a conversation with your mother. Very serious conversation. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> There's the lights, which aren't focusing very well, but never mind. And we're going downstairs. And then we're going to be fire trained on the fire panel. So we'll go outside and get a I'm going to press the button. Very windy evening.
Jag vet inte vad jag ska In there is the computer room. And that's the front door. That's the front office. Oh, so oh, no, I wouldn't. Don't worry. I wouldn't video you if you don't want to be videoed. <laughs> this is my new toy. <laughs> I just filming everything. Now, with my parents, my parents can't come over to Australia, so, uh, so I'll film Australia for them. And here is the dining hall. That's the dining hall. <laughs> and this is where we go in to get food. It's all being packed up now, but that's where it usually is. You can see out of here, there's a very nice view of Telstra Tower. You can see Telstra Tower. That's the courtyard. Oh, and there's the new buildings. Anyway, we're going to... Hello. And there's the fire. Oh, this is a very interesting sort of picture. Yeah, this is John 23rd College, which is a Catholic college, and it's the um, sworn enemy of Bergman College. And on bar night, some of them come over and set the fire alarm off. There's some nice flowers. I'll try and take the flowers. Isn't that nice? The zoo's working rather well now. Anyway, there are nice flowers. Anyway, now we've got fire training, so I better go back inside. Do not touch it. I don't know. There's a beautiful evening scene of Sullivan's Creek, a reflection of twilight in the murky waters, and the campus gradually being enveloped in darkness. And there's Jock with an umbrella. Protecting Pro me from the rain. Protecting me from the rain. Here's the evening. On campus. Telstra Tower. Actually, this must have another program where I can take dark scenes more easily. Oh, well. I won't film. Oh, I don't want to film too many people. That's a very nice um, place called Asian Cafe. I went to that place the first night I was in Canberra, oh no, the first Friday I was in Canberra. I remember because I couldn't find the supermarket, so I had to get some food. And there is PJ O'Reilly's. I don't know what they're doing, I think they must be watching the rugby or something. Anyway, that's a very nice Irish pub. Oh, sorry, Jock, I'm not getting that done. I had my birthday doing there, actually. There's PJs. There's more people sitting outside. I think it's PJs. That's PJs, too. 
I think you're watching rugby. What is it? Well, there's a rugby match this week. Weekend. I did, oh, weekend. England against Australia. Oh, yeah, of course there is. There isn't one during the week. But there's no rugby match during the week. I thought it was. That's quite a nice little alcove. My lighting's not very good. Oh. Anyway, I'll switch it off because it's getting a bit boring now. King O'Malley's, where we're going to go into later. It's a very nice terrace. And this is Garima Place. It's a kind of... This is the... Um, what's the kind of centre of the great metropolis? Well, should I take this too far? Oh no, because I get... There's a sushi bar, which I often go to. Which we often go to. There's some more terraces. Supermarket, where we sometimes go to get food. Where I'll be going a lot more next year. Oh, well, that's quite nice lights too. Another lights. Christmas. Christmas. There is King of Mali. religion which is rugby. I don't know who's playing. It's good zoo. I don't know who's playing who. Anyway we're gonna sit outside we often go to. I'm about to eat some sushi. There's a sushi. Oops. Salmon sushi. And there's the wasabi. And wasabi is very nice. Mm, there we are. Mm. Oh, where, where's the zoom? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Look, top. This one. Mm. This is sushi, which is very nutritious. It's got rice carbohydrate. Oh no. <laughs> very low in fat, and it's got salmon, it's very nice. Can you slowly, slowly, slowly? Alright, yeah. It goes with wasabi. Oh, that was, it's very nice sushi. Anyway, I'm going to finish eating now. Thank you, Jock, for filming. School of Music. It's all quiet now because it's the evening. What about School of Art? And the School of Art. The School of Art. Oh, there's a bloody car coming. Typical. The School of Art is a very nice building. It looks very kind of. It must be 1930s actually. Kind of art deco. Yeah, it's 20, yeah, 20 past nine. There's a nasty car. And you can smell the evening fragrance of flowers. It's lovely coming over on the breeze. I'm not sure where from. It must be Jasmine somewhere. There's a lovely multi-story car park. There's Jock. Hello. And we're just going over to Jock's work. Because Jock's going to pick up a notepad. Bodicin. The Bodicin building. Bodicin. Bodhisattva Precinct building. And here's a lovely car park. Which is empty now, because everybody's gone home. But this is our route back to um, Bergman Shortcut. You can just see Telstra Tower from a distance. From a distance. Oh, I've only got 21 minutes left. Oh no! Why don't you turn off now? Oh no, I want to take the language school. I mean, turn off and then go in. Yeah, maybe you're right, Jock. I think 
it's nice, nice one to see kind of ordinary things. Yeah. If you do this, it's going to be like the Blair Witch Project. Yeah. The viewers are going to... They're experiencing the atmosphere of Canberra. No, they're nauseous. They get nauseous. <laughs> do you know that the Blair Witch Project, the, the first movie, mm. a lot of a lot of people when they watch the movie, they vomit it. Really? Yeah. Oh. What, from fear or just from the, just no, from the camera? No, because of the, the way they film, they, they move the camera around. Yeah, it's... And so it was nauseous. They were trying to be realistic, I suppose. I left halfway, actually. When I first saw the movie. It's not focusing very well. I'll pass this to Dark. Yeah. There's a language school where Josh works. And here there is. I'm not sure what that is. It looks like a temple. And there are wonderful sort of wooden panels. This is the School of Southeast Asian Studies. The School of Southeast Asian Studies. And there's a School of Languages. And School of Languages here. Language yeah. Studies. Language studies. Here's the honours room. <laughs> it's rather interesting painting. I feel very embarrassed this morning. Okay. No. This is Jock's room. Computer. All the linguistics papers. And there's a book by Jock's supervisor called What Did Jesus Mean? Explaining the Sermon on the Mount and the parables in simple and universal human concepts. I love doing this, this with books. I just find the page in a random sentence. It could also be argued that there is a link between God's feeling human pain implied in the Beatitudes and God's identification with suffering people. There we are. That's profound. Well, there's Singapore English in a nutshell. You find a random... It's all very interesting. And there's all Doc Supervisor's books. And we are now leaving the building Back out into the camera night. That's a nice painting. Nice painting. Oh, I've got how many minutes? Oh, I've got 18 minutes left. I don't want on the, the main. I've got another tape though. Hmm? Yeah, we can walk on the main. Oh. I've got a tape number two. This will be a feature. Feature length presentation. I'm going to try zooming again. How's that for zoom? I'm not sure I'm zooming to anything. Where's the moon? I could zoom the moon. No, I think it's, um, zoom to. The sky. I know, it's, it's too cloudy. It's rain tomorrow or oh no. Anyway, this is a bit boring, so I will switch it off now and I will bring you the next instalment when there's something exciting to witness. Something interesting. Can you see the red? Can you see the red? Yeah. You can see a red glow through the windows of the chapel of John 23rd. And we always have an argument about the transubstantiation at this point, because there's always that red glow. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I, I feel self-conscious now. What is the transubstantiation? Are your parents Catholic? Not well, mine. Mm. Oh, my mum is. Okay. Oh no, he converted. To yeah, he converted oh, a few yeah. years back. Have you filmed John Twenty Third? Oh no, they might. Yeah. Do you think they'll get angry if yes, I film? Yes, they might not like it. Is this invasion of privacy? John 23rd, the enemy, the ones who set the fire alarm off all the time. There's a nice rose garden there actually, I don't know if you can see it. In the day. In the day, it's nice. Oh, there's a fly. What about the bus stop? Oh no, there wasn't a bus stop. But you can see the bus stop if you want. There's a bus stop. There's someone playing their music very loudly. 
which often happens in these colleges. Some things aren't different. I actually think that's the bar. Right there is Bergman, where we are now heading. Is it Spice Girls? See, they even listen to the Spice Girls. Okay. How crass. <laughs> if they had any finesse, they'd listen to Beethoven. Or Edith Piaf. Oh, you think you're Link Page? Yeah. Who's your Link Page got? Oh, yeah. Oh, and there's Telstra Tower. I think it's Jasmine. Hmm? It's Jas I think it's Jasmine. It's very nice. Refreshing. Yeah. Nice and refreshing. Are you hungry? No. Eating all the sushi. I could do. Oh no. Well, that tin rice is very nice. But well, I think I've had enough jobs who are absolutely stuffed. Anyway, we are arriving back into the colleges. College. And you've seen the college, so I will now switch off. And there is um, the morning paper. This is um, this Peter <laughs> and breakfast stuff. And it's Saturday morning, so I actually go to breakfast on Saturday morning. And outside. It's raining horribly, which is very good in Canberra. And here's the sort of thing you have for breakfast, cereal, and fruit, yogurt, and fruit juice. Today is the Rugby World Cup final. And they've got a whole section of the newspaper devoted to it. This is a bit insane, really. Anyway, hi! There is the place I work, which is the Search School of Biological Sciences. It's a part of my life I've kept hidden up till this point. There's a lab I work in. My lab bench. It's a bit of a mess. And here's my office. There's a photo. plate of cyanobacteria. I'll try and do a zoom. Well, that hasn't worked very well, haven't I? And there's a plate of another bug I use, which is um, E. coli. Oh, 